All right, this is part one of your igneous rock lab. This is looking at viscosity. So we're gonna do a demonstration or a little experiment to see how fast different fluids will fall down this sheet here. So I have um, a plexiglass here that has a start and a finish and they are 12 inches apart. And then I have three different substances here. I have dish soap, honey, and olive oil. So what I'm gonna do is I will, and I also have a syringe. So I'm going to pull up five milliliters. We're gonna start it here. And once it hits finish, we'll record how long that took. And we could do some calculations to see quite um, how quickly these different substances are traveling 12 inches, okay? So the first one we're gonna do is oil. reference. I have five milliliters of oil in the syringe. I'm going to put it at the start. I will start it now. All right, so that took about seven seconds from start to finish. Okay, the next one I'm going to do is the dish soap. So just for your reference, I do have a little less. Get a little more in there. I have five milliliters of dish soap in the syringe. So I will go ahead and start. So that took about 20 seconds for the dish soap to go from start to finish. Okay, and now our last one is honey. All right, and for your reference, I have five milliliters of honey in the syringe. All right, point it up here, start it. Okay, so if you're gonna run this experiment at home, just note that my honey is at room temperature because if it's cold or in the fridge, it's not gonna work very well, it's gonna take a while. And for other reference, it's summer and it's pretty hot um, and my AC is not super low. So this is a little bit faster than you might see if it's really cold or it's winter. Um, so just be aware of that, but it's affecting all of the substances not just the honey. Almost there. Move this guy out of your way so you can actually see across the finish line. All right, so that was about 70 seconds. Okay, so our first one, our olive oil, took about seven seconds. Our dish soap took about 20 seconds. And our honey took about 70 seconds to go one foot or 12 inches. So you'll do some calculations in your lab and then make some inferences as to which one went quickest, why you think it might, um, and what that shows you about different lavas in, coming out of volcanoes.